after being arrested for impersonating a parent to kidnap a child at a school, bro. What? <laughs> <laughs> Yo. Hey, welcome back to the channel, man. I hope you guys are all doing well, taking care of yourselves as always. Today, I'm in a really good mood because I don't know if you guys have been watching me for a while. If you have, you're goaded and you'd know what I'm talking about here in a sec, right? But bro, one of my biggest I guess, what's the word for it? Grails, right? One of the biggest unreleased songs that Juice has that I've been wanting to have either leaked or released. But obviously, that shit is not going to get released anytime soon. I actually got leaked, bro. 38 special. I, and all I got to say is, man, the song is great. He does like seven flow switches. I wish he stayed on one. Look, look, I'm not even going to spoil the song for y'all. Just go look up 38 special. Let me know what y'all think of it. It finally actually got leaked randomly last night, bro. I was about to go to sleep and I... I get it i'm hyped up but hey welcome back to the channel man today we have a bunch of crazy videos to take a look at starting out with a video that's titled this man right here he tried to stab a police officer after being arrested for impersonating a parent to kidnap a child at a school bro what nah this is one of the most heinous things you can do bro this is one of those things that i don't even think there's a punishment in the united states legal system that you deserve bro like let's just watch the video bro let's get into it if you guys are new here watch the full video through y'all know the drill bro watch the full video through decide for yourself at the end if you want to subscribe if you want to join us all you're gonna get from me is consistent crazy videos every single day and yeah let's get into it man oh my fucking god yo yo <laughs> What the hell? <laughs> wait, 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 run it back, run it back. You cannot tell me this dumb idiot, right? This hollow brained weirdo, this child kidnapping predator just tried to stab a police officer with a fucking pen, bro. Thinking that shit was actually gonna work, thinking he his little twig arms would actually be able to do anything harmful to an officer with a pen. This is one of those things where police brutality is justified, bro. Look, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, what a fucking coward, man. What a what a pathetic existence. I don't shit on people for no reason, by the way. Keep in mind that this dickhead right here was trying to kidnap a child after faking and impersonating that he's their parent and actually kidnapping them by the way i'm pretty sure he he that's why he got arrested is because the, he kidnapped the fucking child no remorse bro this officer can have his ways with him in this room man your hands behind your back now okay. oh surveillance video capture the moment trying to kidnap your subject try to okay Put your hands on your back now. Okay. Oh, yeah. Raid Duran. Why? Why the fuck do all these like weirdos have such exotic names, bro? Stop. Put your hands on your back now. Okay. You fucking kidnapped a child. Okay. Oh, yeah. Put your hands on your back now. Police say Duran allegedly admitted to posing as a parent during the school's open house event to kidnap a five year old. Like, what the fuck can go through your- Hold on. What can go through your mind as a man, bro? As a grown-ass man to do that shit, man? What the fuck? Okay, look, look. The prawn is bad, right? It's bad. It's addicting, especially at a young age. But if you're his age, at, bro, you don't gotta be kidnapping no fucking children. I, I, I can't put myself in the shoes or the mindset of, like, even understanding why they would do this. What the fuck do you- You're going to the depths of hell and you need to be- put in a room with, with somebody who's taking advantage of motherfuckers in prison bro that's what you deserve i don't care what anybody's the guillotine something that is that is worse than worse man put your head like back now okay. stab me, really what are you trying to stab me with what you kidding me according to the court documents duran was not handcuffed initially because he was there voluntarily and wasn't in custody where was the pen 
Authorities say Duan was charged with attempted kidnapping, felonious assaults, and escape. All right, we're done with this video. All I gotta say is, man, when it comes to people like this, there is nothing in the law book that is enough for them, bro. That is the worst of the worst. Satan himself needs to have his way with him, bro, and not in a good, like, he needs something, bro. He needs a different hell for his own. Weirdo, bro. But anyways, let's move on. <laughs> Jiu-Jitsu Black Belt. Idris blah 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 whatever his name is stops a man who had sacked a store employee and socked him in a f what? Yeah, on camera, so if hey, happens, hey, homie, let me you come home, <laughs> homie. No, you who? swung at those dudes. Who? At the employee. At where? Bro, I need to see the video of him actually assaulting the employee because look at the way he has he, <laughs> he has him choking his own self. Yo. You made me move my sandals. Come on, dog. That wasn't me, dog. Damn. That wasn't me, dog. Damn. You think that's me? That ain't me, Joe. Please, bro. That ain't me, dog. That's one thing about martial arts and like learning how to defend yourself. I feel like this is true and all of you can agree with me. You don't get any more higher confidence than, I hope this doesn't sound weird, but looking at yourself in the mirror fully naked and just like being proud of your body, bro. That's, that's number one. That's the highest level of confidence you can ever get. Number two is knowing the fact that you can physically defend yourself against any enemy. That's number two. And number three, bro, when you pull one of the baddest girls that you've ever, ever seen, like that's, that's number three, but that comes last. You what i'm saying and in this case bro right here got handled like a fucking pretzel <laughs> anyways let's move on we got two more videos to watch there's michael jackson Tribune on and i'm terrified what no, I, I have to mute the hold on i have to mute the Is this way? Is this a real thing now? I've seen people all over Twitter talk about this. It was trending at one point. Is this like a real? This has to be fake, bro. Cause how the fuck do you have phobia from Michael Jackson? What? The woman in this video has explained her phobia. I have genuine fear of Michael Jackson. She said it all started when I was younger, at about five years old. My sister, my sister and my cousin used to show me creepy edited videos of him that people made and conspiracy theories like that he's alive. Hardly the kind of stuff you want to be watching as a five year old i don't think that's that fucking scary bros i was watching a plane crash movie before getting on flights at five years old bro i was watching some some pretty crazy things at that age just watching michael jackson is not that scary bro what <laughs> to be fair she went and she went on to say thriller is the main song that scares me because of watching the music video when i was younger and it is one of the biggest hits blah 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 I don't know what the fuck that is, bro. Some people can't be real. That has to be fake. And there's no way you're a grown ass woman crying because there's a Michael Jackson lookalike at the club. <laughs> what? Anyways, let's conclude this video off with the last clip that we have for today. I what is this, sissy? It's a little ass girl on TikTok. What? What you watching, Stinky? Our school shooting. We were just talking about that. What you told that PE teacher and he told you you're not the smartest? I told him that all them intruders did that as kids so they know what to do they gonna shoot the door down put their arm in that door unlock the door and get us <laughs> they gonna get you but no i'm be gone <laughs> you know how i'm gonna run out there while he's shooting them other kids and if if i'm not able to run out then i'm gonna just wipe them other kids blood on me Y'all can't tell me that's not sad to hear, bro. <laughs> that you can't. Yo, she has the same game plan as me. When I look, you know, I'm, I'm fresh out of the system, bro. I'm fresh out of school. So I remember all the time, me and my homies, every time we would do a drill, right? The, what's it called? The fire drill, whatever. Everybody has their own escape plan, blah, blah, blah. But if it, God forbid, ever comes to that, I feel like it's going to be different. But bro, one of the stupidest things, I mean, I understand why, because you want to barricade the kids inside and then wait for the officers to come and rescue everybody, blah, blah, blah. 
blah. But we've seen an example of the officers being pussies, being fucking cowards. So that's not the most reliable one. We've always been talking about this, bro. And the best game plan is to, if you have a window in your room, in, in, in the classroom, get the fuck out through that window as soon as you hear the first pop shot. <laughs> and do not try to sit there and be fucking retarded and act like it's fireworks because it's 100% not. Or, like she said, run out the door if they're not close to you. It's just sad to me that a little ass child like that has to be thinking about scenarios and how she would escape a school shooting and knowing that i have like siblings and shit in school bro that's one thing that's fucking terrifying and i honestly think it's the most pathetic way to go it's even more pathetic than the first video we took we took a look at is to go out as a fucking school shooter bro <laughs> what i hope you guys enjoyed let me know what y'all thought of this whole video and i still can't believe that, that first video bro it's trying to stab an officer with a fucking pen because you got caught being the biggest edp on the planet yeah it's been spirit bro take care of yourselves drink a lot of fucking water stay healthy hit the gym all that hey i'll see you on the next video bro i'm out